Hey everybody, welcome back to Millennial Living. My name is Lindsay and today we're gonna go over some fall decor that I bought and do a little bit of decorating with me. I didn't get a whole lot this year because we're not home that often and I don't really decorate the whole house, but I do have this little tray back here, all right there <laughs> that I like to decorate um, for every season. And then I got a wreath and a few little outdoor decorating accessories. I did get most of the stuff at Walmart and TJ's. So the first things that I got is a couple candles. This one is the Glade Cozy Cider Sipping one. It smells so good. It smells very warm and spicy. And then from TJ's, I got the DW Home Richly Scented Candle in Pumpkin Spice. Or spiced pumpkin, same thing. This one smells like fresh pumpkin pie, which is amazing. And I love that it's in this really nice glass jar. I also always love to get a little festive mug for, you know, most of the holidays. So this is my fall one. It has a little bit of cream, light pink, and then a nice orange with this brown speckle on it. Really nice, got it at TJ's. And I like that it's not too um, Thanksgiving or Halloween. It's more just like an overall fall mug. For my tabletop decor, I did get a few little things to stick on my tray that's over here. So I got this little pumpkin um, plate kind of thing that I'm going to stick some of these little fake gourds on. And I got this little white and gold speckled pumpkin. It's really light. I think it's foam. It came from Walmart. And then I got this bigger ceramic pumpkin that is this really nice purple. Like it's a very deep purple with the little gold stem on it. So I really like that it's kind of different. It's not too Halloween-y. And then I got this trio of gourds from TJ Maxx that are all ceramic um, with the kind of brown speckle at the top and then the orange at the bottom. So we're gonna use those on the tabletop. And then for the outdoor decor, um, we have a couple coach lights on each side of our garage. So I found these garlands of um, leaves at Walmart. They're just plastic, which is perfect for outdoors. I'm just gonna wrap them around the coach lights. So I have this one that's more like yellow and orange, and then I have this one that is more like red and yellow. And then to go on those, I picked up some of these flowers that they have that just like kind of clip on, and I figure I will clip them on to um, the things maybe in a little cluster to go on the coach lights. And then I picked up one of each of these sparkly gold leaves to put on there as well just to add a little something and then the main thing that we got for outside is our wreath this i found at tj's and i love how it looks so gorgeous i love that it's not too halloweeny um it's not too like orange i like that it's good for overall fall not just one month out of fall we also got a couple little scarecrows that we already put outside, so I will show you guys those in a second. But right now, let's get to the tabletop. I haven't decorated over here since Easter, which is why all of this is kind of Eastery stuff. Um, I've been a little bit lazy about it, but I'm ready to get back into the swing of things. So I'm gonna take all of my Easter stuff off of here. So whenever I'm setting up my table, like display kind of decorating, I like to just sit everything out and then figure out, you know, going back and forth, how do I want it to be put? And I just maneuver things around constantly until I get it to where I want it to be. I did have a lot of bigger things this time around, so it was a little bit harder. Um, so maybe for Christmas, I will go a little bit smaller with some of the things. And then I took a couple of those berries and leaves from the garlands for outside and popped those on there just to add a little bit more color. And I really like how that ended up turning out. Um, and then situate the candles and grandma back in her place and we're done with that. Now outside we have the scarecrows. I got these for seven bucks at Walmart. We have one on either side. And then here are the garlands for the coach lights. Really love how these turned out, nice and simple and just kind of festive and pretty. And then next up we have the wreath, which I love how that turned out to look. It looks great from the street also. And then last we have the little boy scarecrow. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Thank you.